The leg curl is the second exercise in the strength training machine drill. This exercise develops strength in the back of the upper leg muscles. Here is a breakdown of the exercise as it would be conducted by an individual soldier. The starting position for the leg curl is the prone position, knees aligned with the center axis of the machine. The lower leg pad is adjusted to contact the lower legs just above and behind the ankle, allowing the lower legs to be fully extended. The lower legs and feet are relaxed. The thigh pad is positioned just above and in front of the knees. The hips, stomach, and chest are firmly against the bench with the eyes looking straight down. Select the appropriate weight and ensure the pin is secure in the weight stack. Hands are relaxed and placed on the hand grips. On count one, slowly pull the lower legs to the rear toward the buttocks. On count two, return to the starting position by slowly lowering the lower legs. Repeat this movement for the correct number of repetitions and sets required to meet the goal of the strength machine session. The modified leg curl is performed in the prone position through a limited range of motion. Soldiers with low back or hip injuries may prefer to use the seated leg curl if it is available. Keep the chest flat on the bench. The legs may be extended or partially flexed. Grab the handles of the machine. From the starting position, curl the legs up as far as possible without lifting your upper legs from the pad. Pause for a second then return the legs slowly to the starting position. Repeat this movement for the correct number of repetitions and sets required to meet the goal of the strength machine session. The single leg curl is performed in the prone position using only one leg at a time. As the soldier's condition improves, the range of motion and resistance may gradually increase until the exercise is performed to standard. However, do not increase both of these factors at the same time. The single leg curl is used to maintain a heavy resistance on the good leg or to reduce the resistance or decrease the range of motion on the injured leg.